Welcome back. Uh, this will be Aeroplane Base Licks number four. And uh, we're at the end of the tune here. So just on the bass solo, just on the bass solo. Oh, wait. Now, the, the beauty, I mean, that's like, like a song wasn't enough, and then he just crushes it with this beautiful ascent, descent, back up, and back down. And then it just like, you know, just like all comes crashing down in this beautiful, um, uh, it's just, it's so cool. It's just such a great way to end such an insane song. Um, so yeah, so bass solo, uh, boom, boom. Right to the G, and again, G to C, all day long. It's this is just beginning to end. It's all G to C. So, uh, but let me give you the notes because it that's and that's what I had to do. I think I, I looked it up on YouTube or I forgot. I figured and it was just like note for note. What you know what I mean? Rather than um, he's ascending the scale of X or whatever. I don't know. I'm sure he's ascending some sort of G scale shape, whatever. Um, sorry, I got a cough drop in my. So we'll start on G, um, third fret, okay, boom, boom, and you know what, let me just call out the numbers, uh, so that way the beginners, you guys are, everybody, whatever, everybody knows, it's all the same, it's all the same shit, so three, and then we're going to the A string, uh, open one, two, three, five, six, eight, ten, and then we go to the G, the D string, uh, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve, thirteen, and G, G string, ten, twelve, and then now we're gonna go down, but we're going down a different way than we came up. At least I do. I, you could probably play this in a different way, but this is just how I play it. Uh, twelve, ten, thirteen, twelve, ten, thirteen, twelve, eleven, ten, eight, six, five, three, six, Five, four, three, open. One, two, three, five, six, eight, ten, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve, thirteen, ten, twelve, ten, thirteen, twelve, ten, thirteen, twelve, eleven, ten, eight, six, five, three, six, five, four, three. So those are the notes, and then again, listen to the recording, whatever. And this is where it gets cool too, because it's it's again, you know, it's not it's not just it's and you can kind of play with your muting a little bit too. So, sorry, I, but I gave you all the, the notes. So that is like a, cause he does like a, like a, that's one, two, three, four, da, bum, 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 ba, da, 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 dum, bum, ba, la, ba, la, ba, la. And that's where I'll, I'll pull off to that open string just real quick. Bum, bum, bum. Um, uh, um, um, uh, 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 uh. Oh, yeah, another thing I'll do. Hang on. 12, 10, 13, 12, 10, 13, 12. And then I'll go 11. That's a cool to throw that little. um. So. And then you do it again. Uh, it's. Uh, whatever. I don't know. I don't know if he does that or not, but I started doing it. It was kind of a cool, you just sneak it in. In the middle of this huge passage, you know, you still have like a little, eh, and it kind of, you know, maybe in the, on the down low or whatever, it's, it's, it's kind of funky, but, um, 
12, oh wait, 3, open, 1, 2, 3, 5, 6, 8, 10, 7, 8, 9, 10, 12, 13, 10, 12, then 13, 12, 10, 13, 12, 11, 10, 10, 8, 6, 5, 3, 6, 5, 4, 5, 3. And then this is, it, they just kind of, you know, it goes off and into a little, just like some creaky something sound. And um, what's cool for us, so I play in a trio and uh, it's it's a guitar, bass and percussion. And which is why we kind of, we focus on wineries. There's a huge, I live near Lodi, California. And um, there's probably like 60 plus tasting rooms in the area. And for guys, for me and my bandmates, uh, wineries are the perfect venue. They're, they're, they're always like nice and beautiful places. Uh, everybody gets all fixed up and it comes out. It's just like a real nice crowd. And, um, uh, what was my point here? Uh, but, so we'll play this. Uh, and again, I have a percussion, so we're not, we're not like, we, but it, it comes out pretty good. You know, we're able to rock it pretty good. So we end up jamming the end of this. Um, and sometimes it can get wild. Like we played, the great festival in Lodi last year. And we actually, we have, this is the first time we ever played. We had a full on stage and a, a PA and a sound guy. And so we had huge subs. And I mean, it was like a huge sound and we played it. And we uh, actually for that though, for the bigger shows, we do play with a, our friend, uh, Tom a drummer plays a full kit and stuff. And we killed it. And the airplane was great. The jam after was, was incredible it was so fun and again it's still because it's really simple uh and it's just g and c and so um so yeah so we'll do play it just like in the tune we'll do the the ascending and then as descend ascend and then on the last one And this is what I'll, I'll usually do is to C, and then up here to the, to the G, to the C, to the G, to the C, to the G. And this is, this will be the, usually I open with this lick here, would be. So I'm just a um, root five octave. Real basic, like pentatonic, I guess. Again, I don't know. I don't know a lot about what the hell I'm doing here, but I just like, this is what's worked. Just trying to help. So um, if you're playing with your buddies or whatever, like if you can get through all of that uh, and you get to the end, it's just a jam in G and C. Um, but that, like, the, what's cool is going to the F. So, boom. And then I'll go to the F, but the octave. And again, I'm the kind of like groove oriented player. I mean, I just say that because, you know, I don't, I don't know. I, I like, I've just gotten used to, you can give me one like chord or, you know, one or two chords, like a simple, and I'll just play it. I can play it all night. You know what I mean? Like I just, when you're in, when you're grooving and it feels so sweet to me, it feels so sweet when you find that, when you find that feel and it's like, I want to play that all night. And so, um, uh, I'm not in a hurry to get on to the next whatever, you know, especially if you got people that are up dancing and you're having a good time and it's like, hey, what you, this is pretty cool. You know, let's just hang out here for a while. Um, so I wanted to share that because we love playing aeroplane and we've gotten good like uh, feedback from from people that hear us play it. And but for and for, I don't know, for me personally, I can just uh, speak that the jam has just gotten really fun.
And, um, and it's a great way to start a jam is to play, oh, let's play an airplane that goes into this jam. Um, <clears throat> excuse me, I got a little, little uh, allergy thing. But um, at any rate, that is airplane. I got one more video and actually, ironically, I'm going to, I'm going to play the intro part that, that, uh, real soft that starts the song. I, I skipped it cause I don't have the right bass, but F it because I wanted to kind of just wrap up this whole, uh, aeroplane, um, package of videos today. Today I got the place to myself and, um, I got a little window here. So that, uh, that wraps that one up. This is four. Aeroplane 4, um, I'm going to come out with 5th, which is actually should have been number 1, but that's just how, that's just how it goes, you know? <laughs> All right, I hope, uh, I hope all's well out there. Thanks.